Okay, so the boys wanted something nice to eat, so I took this car today. You can't use just any car. That one would not have worked for what I did now. And this one either, it wouldn't have worked. But that one did. So I'm feeding them. They're eating early today, but it's just because this is a one time thing. Dainty, come on. So this is some pieces of meat, but it's a little tough, but it's okay. Last time I checked, they were tigers, and uh, tough is all they are. <laughs> so look at that, he just swallows them all. And there's a lot here, I've already fed them. Well, half of this so I'm just gonna feed them a bit more and this comes from Benny okay that maybe that'll keep your mouth shut let's give one to Dainty as well <laughs> Diego doesn't like to catch hey what happened to Benny where's Benny <laughs> there's some pieces that's got bone on as well but they are careful when they eat them there's a piece of bone lying there that he found in it and he is taking his time chewing it nicely i look after the teeth very well because i am convinced that as long as the teeth are healthy they will be healthy so that's the main thing I consider when it comes to any kind of food that they are about to eat. There you go, Diego. And I really think that they can live maybe till 40 years of age. I can't see why not. But in the wild, I know 10 years and those teeth are worn down. So... We're not going to put them through any of those exercises at all. Because that would just be unnecessary. Dainty. Now he swallows that little piece. I hope it keeps him busy for a while. But yeah, you cannot believe how easily they can eat something this tough. Now it is cut in smaller pieces. But you'd think that they would want to just, well, let's say, chew it first, but they don't really need to. They can just swallow it whole if they like. Well, Pokey's not going to be able to do that, but Pokey is the biggest animal at the zoo house at the moment. If you're going according to square meters or square feet. <laughs> The tigers are not as big as he is, but they do swallow bigger things. <laughs> Look at him feeling for that bone. And it doesn't matter, he swallows the bone. I remember with Ozzy years ago, the doctor was here and we had to work on him. And he had an intestine that would twist and then he would be very very sick and when you find that bone in his stomach it is totally crumbled you can press with your finger and you will crush it it is totally dissolved you cannot believe that that heart bone dissolves totally and eventually it just becomes absolutely dust. So, believe me, the acid in any stomach, for that matter, is really supposed to be acid. Because that way, if you swallow something that is not supposed to be swallowed, dainty, even that would be 
totally dissolved. And that's where I always tell people, Dainty! That's where I always tell people, be very careful, do not drink something that will, well, turn the acid in your stomach more alkaline. Because you're not going to be able to digest your food then. And that is a big, a bigger problem that people might think. That is probably one of the biggest problems you can have. And if you drink only clean water, clean water is very much towards the alkaline state. Last time I checked it was about 7.4, where an acidic level of 1 is usually in the stomach. So you can think for yourself what happens when you drink pure water and you let it mix with the acid in your stomach well my common sense tells me this is not medical advice but my common sense tells me you're going to dilute that acid to about the three I'd say and that is not potent enough to dissolve Food. You need an acidic level of 1 in your stomach to be able to get all the vitamin B's and whatever there is out of it. So keep that in mind always. It's a good thing to keep in mind. You never know when you might just realize Okay, I'm going to eat this, but I'm not going to drink that. Or other way around. There's another bone on this one, Enzo. So if you drink something like we call it cold drink in South Africa, but some places they call it pop or whatever, like Coca-Cola. As far as I can remember, that had an acidic level of about 2.7. So you will not dilute the acidity of the acid in your stomach which is one as much with coca-cola as you would with water that's just i think it's science or is that just common sense <laughs> but you have to think about these things and that's what i like about getting older i have spent time thinking about this and you can't think about this in a day or two not even in a year you have to think 20 years about something like this and test all the different ways that it can turn out so that you know what you're talking about because a lot of people just talk about what they heard today and that is a big problem because they haven't considered other factors and they will only come around those factors in 10 years in 20 years maybe even in 50 years so be careful before you start talking about something and even if it is just for conversation it could very well help someone or it could very well damage someone so you have to be very careful with anything that you say especially when it comes to 
advice on medical stuff. I don't give advice, I just state reasonable facts and people can eat what they want. Tigers can eat what they want. Animals are so noisy, except tigers. You can hear him chewing that bone, and he spits the bone out. <laughs> and they're so friendly with each other, these two. Guys, this is now two tigers while they're eating. Nice snacks. And they have got such good manners with one another. They truly understand that they are both eating. I think your stomach is bulging a little, Enzo. I think you guys are done for the day. There's a few left. I don't think I should give them all. Maybe tomorrow I'll give you these. I don't want to overdo it now. I'll give you each one more. Let's take... Uh, I have to take the papers off. Just this one. It's almost like pokey thinks I'm throwing something over here that he could have saved or which he knew, and he's screaming, no! <laughs> okay, guys, that's it. I'm done with it. I'll take this into the fridge, and we will give them that, maybe tonight, but I think they ate for the day. So they are fed. That was easy. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching on this noisy day. <laughs> Noisy, lazy day. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.